This is Dr. Sam Benjamin. No sweat. Uh, while the expression is typically used to suggest that something is no big deal, no sweat. In fact, with all of this hot weather, and we're having really hot weather, there is a concern about no sweat because sweat cools us, and this is really important if you suffer, for example, from migraine headaches. Some drugs increase dehydration or interfere with the body's own cooling mechanisms, the tryptan, such as sumatriptan, many of you with migraines know about it, imatrex, along with other neurologic or psychiatric medications, can inhibit the body's natural cooling process by interfering with thermal control messaging between the brain and the rest of the body, resulting in no or less sweat, according to David W. Claypool, MD, an emergency physician at Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. Now, this can result in overheating and more and more intense migraine headaches. That's a big deal. Seizure medications and antihistamines like Claritin and Benadryl, as well as Parkinson's disease medications, also work to inhibit sweat production. Sweating is important. Blood pressure medications such as beta blockers, metoprolol, atetalol, etc. There especially, they, they can decrease our natural cooling by slowing the heart rate. Now, I take a beta blocker, and there is no doubt that I've noticed that since I take one, I don't tolerate summer heat as well, and I used to before I started taking a beta blocker. And how about diuretics? They make you urinate more and are among the top drugs that lead to dehydration. If you're taking these and possibly other medications, you need to keep cooler, like in rooms with air conditioners, and drink more than you might before you were on these drugs. Be careful. Think about the medications that you take. Check with your doctor.